Welcome everybody to the inner confines of the Devonshire Maker household and this is the formal dining room. Actually this is not so much formal nor a dining room anymore. Uh, the table and chairs are gone and uh, the idea with this room is we need some more working space and we need a lot more storage in this house. So this room, I'd like to do a multi-video series about turning this space into some new office working space, but also building a ton of built-in storage along this wall, uh, this window wall here. When we moved into the house, we put a table in here, called it the formal dining room. We only ate in here a handful of times, and really it was kind of more of a storage room. And eventually Charlie's house got put in here because it was the only spot it would really fit. A few years ago, when we were thinking about how to redo this room because we weren't using it as a dining room, we talked about turning it into a game room and having a table and chair set up in here so you could play bigger games and leave those boards set up over a period of time. They wouldn't be taking up space where you'd actually eat, they'd be in a separate room. And with the events that occurred in 2020 and the work from home movement becoming more and more popular, that idea was kind of put on the back burner and now we're thinking that this room would be better utilized as office space and game room. This room is 13 feet this way by 11 feet this way. So 143 square feet total. You can handle a good size table and chairs set right here in the middle. Uh, but if you want to put things in the sides of the walls here, it does cut into that you know, walking space around the table. We had can lights installed and we ran some built-in speakers in the ceiling uh, years ago. So we're gonna keep those elements in here. This wall is where we'd like to put a desk, uh, a little small home office desk in this space here. Nothing terribly long, maybe five feet by a couple feet out. Um, enough to hold a laptop and a monitor and keyboard mouse and maybe a little basket for bills and mail and things like that. This wall actually gets a lot of light from the uh, neighbor's house. Uh, it, that reflects a lot of sunlight and comes in through the window and kind of lights up this wall. So it's not a terrible spot to sit and work during the day. Along this wall is where I want to put in some built-in cabinetry, uh, floor to ceiling cabinets. Maybe a, a break here on the lower cabinets and put a little countertop on it so you can put some drinks or you know beverages, things like that on both sides. Try to make them as big as possible to hold the vast game collection that we seem to have amassed the last couple of years. There is a heating register, a supply right here on the floor. So that means that we'll have to figure out if we're gonna build something, you know, in this space here, like a little window seat, take that heating supply and just, you know, bend it out like this and get it out to the room versus burying it, of course. But we haven't fully decided what we're gonna do in, uh, in this lower space, the window here yet. And the other thing we have in this room is uh, for our dog, Charlie, his little house crate is in this room. Uh, he likes laying here during the day and it's a safe spot for him. Um, but our plans for this room are gonna put the cabinetry in this corner. So we might need to find a new home for this. But, Hey, 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 you say hi? Right? Okay, you're in my shot. Yeah, you're in my shot. Oh, you're a good boy. You're a good boy. Hey. Yeah. I'm gonna get some of the stuff cleared out of here and then we'll talk about plans for the room. The cabinetry is gonna come up pretty close to the corner of this window trim. So what I'd like to do is end the cabinetry somewhere close to this and then just replace all of this. It's old, it's been painted a number of times, it just needs to go. Light fixture is gonna be replaced as well. Something that's probably a little more flush ceiling mount so that you can walk underneath it more. This one's a little close to your eyes. On the window wall, we are going to put matching cabinetry on both sides of the window, floor to ceiling. My hope is that the recessed can lights in the ceiling will shine down on the uppers, so it'll give a little bit of a highlight up there. 
Right now, I'm thinking under the window is just a simple kind of window seat with a fold up top that has some additional storage. On the opposite wall, I'm gonna do a very simple desk build that can hold a monitor and laptop and basic office materials. Above the desk, maybe some floating shelves or something a little more substantial in terms of size, hold more office materials or more games. In terms of the walls, what I'd like to do is take some sandpaper and sand these walls down. You can see that the texture on these walls is almost like an orange peel texture, but that's just from paint rollers over the years. It's not a intended drywall texture at all. So I'd like to get these walls knocked down a little smoother and then repaint these uh, stripes back on the wall. I'm going to wrap this video up here and uh, talk to you about some of the room prep things I did. You just saw me remove some of these pop nails out of this one long wall. I patched those up and put some screws above and below each patch there to make sure the drywall is nice and secure to the wall and there's no more movement there. I also did take some sandpaper to the walls and try and get some of these high bumps and imperfections off the wall. It did help. It was a bit of a workout, but it did, did help overall. And now the walls are primed and ready for paint. And in the next video, I'm gonna start building the cabinets themselves. So please stick around for that. Hope you like this one. There's more to come here on this room renovation. Uh, if you're not following yet, please subscribe. It helps me out a lot. And uh, give me a thumbs up if you like this content. Thank you for watching and I will see you on the next one.